In the quiet German island of Feynman, a colossal 7.5 billion engineering project is underway, set to redefine travel across Europe. The ScanMed corridor, a vital part of the trans-European transport network, stretches almost 5,000 kilometers from Malta to Finland. However, an inconvenient stretch of water called the Feynman Belt has forced a 500-kilometer detour through Denmark. Initially, Feymarn Belt Tunnel plans involved a massive three-kilometer-long cable-stayed bridge, similar to the Orison Bridge. Yet challenges arose due to the Feymarn Belt's depth, poor soil conditions and the impact of prevailing winds. Eventually, the idea of a bridge was discarded, leading to the exploration of alternative options. Enter the Immersed Tube Tunnel, IMT, an innovative solution for the Feymarn Belt. The 18-kilometer tunnel, set to be the world's longest immersed tunnel, will host two railway tunnels, two motorway tunnels, and a service route side by side. The construction process involves creating tunnel segments in a massive factory on land, transporting them to the seabed and assembling them in a trench, eliminating disturbances to the delicate ecosystem above. The Feymarn Belt Tunnel construction site, managed by the Danish state-owned company Feymarn AS, is a colossal endeavor covering half a million square meters. The 89 tunnel elements, each 220 meters long and 40 meters wide, are being produced in six production halls. The process is meticulous, involving detailed planning and coordination to ensure precise alignment during installation. The Feymarn Belt Tunnel construction, while groundbreaking, has faced opposition from environmentalists and local residents concerned about its impact on the Feymarn Belt's ecosystem. However, Feyman AS emphasizes rigorous monitoring to minimize environmental impact with real-time data transparency. The Feyman Belt Tunnel aims to revolutionize European travel by shortening the route between Hamburg and Copenhagen, reducing reliance on air travel, and promoting green transportation corridors. The ambitious project, set to open in 2029, comes with a hefty price tag, but half a billion dollars in EU subsidies and a loan from the Danish state repaid through toll revenue, aim to mitigate costs. Despite concerns and controversies, mega projects like the Feyman Belt Tunnel exemplify the evolving landscape of infrastructure, showcasing the intricate dance between engineering innovation, environmental considerations, and societal needs.